live events. Networking, applause, lights, speakers, paper tickets, big screens, queuing, hotel rooms, after show drinks and hugs. After 18 months without, we can finally return to live events. But how do we move from the virtual world with the accessibility and innovation that we have learned over the last year to a new world that combines the live and the virtual? Q futuristic tunnel. Hybrid events, the term on everyone's lips. What is it? How does it work? Why you should be doing it? And how do you do it? Hybrid events have been around for ages. Think about TV talent shows, X Factor, America's Got Talent, Britain's Got Talent, Eurovision, live televised sports like the Olympics, the FIFA World Cup, and don't forget Wimbledon. It's simple. Hybrid events are the combination of both a live in-person event and remote streamed content utilizing the opportunity to showcase content in front of a live audience to a remote audience and showcase remote content to both live and virtual audiences, as well as incorporating interaction from both the live audience and the virtual audience at home by way of voting, commenting or contributing. Simple, right? Okay, maybe I need to go into more detail. Let's think about a live event. You have a stage, some screens, some speakers, a live audience, your presenter and their PowerPoint, there is discussion topics, lunch breaks, all of the usual ingredients of a live event. But you also have a global audience who can't all justify flying across the world. Perhaps they have family commitments or access needs that mean that they can't travel to your venue. You also have the very best presenters who want to speak, but they can't all attend in person but would be happy to speak if they can do that remotely. So why stop them? Hybrid events are all about bringing the best of virtual and live together to enhance the experience for a wider audience. Bring that remote audience into the live space on relay screens. Showcase your presenters on the big screen. Add in interactive mobile device-based Q&A and voting for both the live and the virtual audience. Breakout rooms in the physical space and the virtual space and design your AV and set to integrate a parallel experience for both live and remote. Why? Well, first of all, because we can. Audiences will soon demand the option and the event world needs to be accessible to everyone. And by making it accessible, you enhance the opportunities to spread your message to wider your audiences and with a more diverse range of speakers. Don't compromise, go hybrid. To start planning your hybrid event, get in touch with us at info at virtualapproval.com. Thanks for watching.